Hey, I'm Ryan Dudek with Honda Power Sports, and I'm here with Shane Drew from our race team, HRC Progressive Race Team now. We're here to talk about our 2025 CRF 250 RWE. A couple cool things about this bike is our 250 got an all new change this year, and then on top of that, we brought out a works edition, which is now the R, the WE is for works edition. They copied our 450. Coming from the development side, it's something that we always wanted to do, and now that we have a 250 team in-house, we thought it was the right perfect time. perfect sense, yeah, to incorporate some more stuff from our race team into the production bike in a works edition. A couple of the points, it, it kind of copies a lot of the things of the, the 450, but one of the cool things that this bike has that the, the 451 doesn't have is that it gets the hydraulic clutch, and that doesn't come on the standard bike, but right. now it comes on this 250 RWE. Right. So, and then shared shared parts are the air cleaner the wheels the the grips the handlebars the coating so yeah, the suspension hand coatings fork slide pipe and outer pipe a little bit different setting inside got some real cool um, adjusters you can do manually on the compression side yeah shock has a 18 shaft which also uh, Kashima coating on the shaft and a little bit of different setting inside to accommodate the the larger shaft diameter chassis wise other than the whole new platform this year that's basically the difference on the chassis side for the we the engine for 2025 we got a new air box and new exhaust but so this one shares the air box with the standard model but has the twin air air filter and then the ECU settings are updated to match the Yoshimura pipe and then on top of that we do we clean up the intake and exhaust ports and with a hand polishing those we have a throttle jockey seat cover, rib seat cover, mm -hmm. just like our race team, exactly the same as our race team actually, and Renthal Good. Kevlar grips. And then it has a red backgrounds. We used to do the numbers when we first came out with the works edition and then some people, they just like to put on their own numbers. So we just went with the red backgrounds and then <laughs> hopefully we'll keep those throughout the year for Yeah, hopefully race. we've been fortunate <laughs> enough know. to have a lot of red backgrounds on the race team the last couple of years. So hopefully this is... Uh, going forward how it always stays so the the concept of the we a few years back was to kind of take what the race team was doing and then give it to the customer a copy of roxon's bike with his number and graphics and performance like not just copying the look of the the race bike but we wanted to add performance to the machine too to give give value to the customer so with that with the yoshimir exhaust and the big thing was i know the some people say it's a minor minor head work with the polished ports but it really does a really good job of just cleaning up the airflow through the difference. head and it makes a big difference on the power so the two key points of that and then the other stuff is accessories you can buy but it's a lot of things that the customers were already doing after they buy the bike so we're able to bring those parts on this bike at a low lower price than you'd be able to just buy them and piece them together at a dealership yeah the upgraded show of components make a big difference um almost to the value of a eight kit suspension and then don't forget we got our dunlop tires just like our race right. team so this bike here it comes with everything you see here and we talked about we didn't mention the t dunlop tires our standard bike comes with the pirellis but the race team uses the dunlops and we also went with the wider rear tire so and then the gold chain we didn't mention earlier as well so that's just kind of the extra touch and a little bit more durability out of the chain so all this comes the price is ten thousand five hundred ninety nine standard bike is eight thousand two hundred ninety nine twenty three hundred dollars difference big amount of money when you're looking at a dealership but for what you get it's it's quite a, a good deal to source all these aftermarket parts and everything it's it's pretty difficult to do that on a large production scale so we are bringing in about 500 units of these total and they're available now with all those extra changes i mean this is quite a bit better performing 250 than our standard version which makes it a great bike to go racing on and um, honda also offers a large contingency program so you can check that out on our website go racing have fun